I observed the 2024 eclipse at a site just to the east of Ash Flat, Arkansas, that was near the center line of totality. I obtained photos with a Nikon Z6II and a 560 millimeter lens. I used an ISO of 400 and an aperture of f11. I also used other uh, parameters. In order to capture various features of the corona, I used exposure bracketing with exposure times ranging from 1 250th of a second to 1 second. I was recovering from a neck injury and the sun was high in the sky, so I did the focusing with the display rather than trying to contort my neck to see through the viewfinder. The focus turned out to be pretty good, but not perfect. This is one of the series of nine bracketed exposures. This exposure shows some of the prominences. The one at the bottom was easy to see with the naked eye during the eclipse. This exposure shows details further out in the corona. I used a DJI Phantom 4 Pro drone to obtain video footage. I aimed the camera toward the southwest, which was the approximate direction of the approaching shadow. It turned out that the camera was aimed a bit to the right of the approaching shadow. In this image, the zone of totality is still far off in the distance where the sky appears dark. In this image, the zone of totality has gotten closer and the shadow of the moon is visible in the sky, but offset to the left. The ground nearby appears slightly darker. In this image, the sky is getting brighter far in the distance where the zone of totality has passed. The ground nearby is getting darker. In this image, the sky continues to brighten far in the distance and the ground nearby is much darker. In this image, the sky in the distance is much brighter and totality has reached the site where the drone was launched. In this image, the sky in the distance continues to brighten. The site where the drone was launched is still in totality. In this image, the trailing edge of the shadow has appeared just below the horizon and to the left of center. This edge moves several times faster than a commercial jetliner. In this image, the edge has moved closer and totality is about to end at the site where the drone was launched. In this image, totality has just ended at the site where the drone was launched. In the remainder of this movie, the entire drone video plays back at full speed.